Hi guys, welcome to Joseph IT, your technology entertainer. Today in this video tutorial, I'll be showing you how to write product or how to set your pen drive read only with CMD menu. The benefit of this task are no one can format your pen drive, no data can be deleted from it, and nothing can be copied into your drive until you want. So let's do it. I'm going to my computer. And as you can see, there's a pen drive inserted in my system. Okay, I'm going to CMD. And now, just type in disk part. You can see on the screen, hit enter. And now, tap list disk. Hit enter. And now, all the disks, drives, is connected to your PC will be shown. Now disk 1 is my pen drive and I'm choosing this one. So what I need to do, I'm typing select disk 1 and hitting enter. And now as you can see disk 1 is selected and now what I need to type is attribute disk set read only. Read only and hitting enter. And now as you can see disk attribute set successfully and type exit okay it is now exited now if I go to my pen drive you will be able to see that if I try to format the drive I shall not be able to do it the disk is now right protected okay if I go inside the pen drive there are some files as you can see if I try to delete those those will not be deleted yep as you can see it is right protected okay this is the task of the first session now you may ask how to gain the access to the pen drive again according to the main owner so if you want that the pen drive should be normal again like the earlier time what you should do simply go to the CMD again and repeat all the commands you did at the first time disk part okay now type list disk and now type select disk one again and when it is selected type attribute disk and now type clear and now read only and then simply hit enter and now the read only mode is cleared and now your pen drive is normal again okay and now the pen drive is normal again now you can format it delete files and can copy files into your pen drive easily like earlier and this is a simple way of turning your pen drive write protected and read only mode and lastly, if you found this video useful, then please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to this channel of Joseph IT. If you really have any better idea than this, then why don't you comment us and inform us the way that we can make a video with it. See you in my next video tutorial. Until then, goodbye.